And it's great to see so many of them standing together as well. There is a real friendly atmosphere around what is, of course, a friendly, but one that will teach us a great deal about Brazil's Olympic chances and indeed their future. And just where Argentina are, they're top of the CONMEBOL qualifying for the next World Cup, for which, of course, Brazil don't have to qualify. But Argentina have frailties at the back that this Brazilian side will certainly hope to exploit. Neymar leads the line along with... To win the Olympics and then go on from there and, and gradually grow the team. Little touch there by Marcelo. And then the header by Neymar. And already the ball just rolled out of play. Fernando Gago caught in the face there with the... With a big career ahead of him, as does this man, Neymar, just trying to... Neymar looking to get involved straight away. Good chest down there by Damiao, and it's Neymar! Well, they built the mood so well, the finish wasn't there at the end of it, but... Mightily impressive, this. Good ball played in. It was there to be attacked by Damiao. Takes as well from the Argentinians. Given away there by Sosa. But he gets it back. And another player down holding his face. It's been... Uh, if he wants him. Here's Marcelo. Again, they pour forward, but again, the finish is a weak one. Yeah, a good build-up again. I've got to say, he did try to, to really power it. Very much a team at the start of its career, this Brazilian one, and here's Neymar. Crowd love it. They love the way that they've started this game, but, of course, they're hungry for a goal. Yeah, a good link-up again between Neymar and Hulk. And it just takes it, just takes the player away, just gives him that half a yard. Argentina on the counter, but just about the first time, and here goes Messi. Dangerous, and here he is again. Ooh. Neymar caught, and that will be a yellow card. No real option there for the referee. No, it's straightforward, wasn't it? It's uh, definitely yellow. A little bit of a lunge there. A little swivel of the hips there from Neymar. About uh, Messi not having much of the ball, to be fair, the Argentinian team they haven't had much possession. And there's been very little build-up play, a couple of real breakaways, more than anything. Lovely nutmeg by Di Maria. Away from the second... It's a lovely ball forward, it's a big chance! And Hulk Severt, saved by Romero. He's on his left foot where he likes it, but the goalkeeper denies it. Well, it's a great ball into his part. There's Hulk, and it was legal. And in the end, he decides it wasn't. A little bit of a mismatch, wasn't it, when this ball comes? It just... A little bit of a, a nudge with his arm. As many Brazilian players do before going to Porto. Here's Neymar. A good pair of hands, Romero, hasn't he? He's, he's looked uh, quite impressive under pressure so far. His dribbling skills, as does this man, Lionel Messi. The players get on the ball, they get all excited and... It's usually after they do. A lovely touch from Neymar. He wanted it played back in, and eventually it was, but he's offside. Great movement, hasn't he? Unbelievable. Long to Higuain. But in the same way, Frank, that you're maybe unconvinced by Hulk, I suspect from the way you're talking, you're quite convinced by Neymar. I think um, in, the, in the game that, that we did it, Playing behind a front man and receiving the ball, running, running at people. You see with his close control and his pace, and his, uh, you know, he sees little things before they happen. A little bit. Of... American Player of the Year, and he's just 20, and it's taken quickly, and it's a big chance, and Romero can't keep it out this time. 
Argentina's defensive frailties to the fore again. They went to sleep at the free kick. And what a blow. Brilliant start for Brazil. Crucial, crucial goal from Romulo. This is very, very tight. I don't know, there was part of his body, we didn't see it again, but there was part of his body in front of the, of the line, and that's why the Argentinian players have got their hands up. But he's got, they heard no whistles, he went up and scored. Free kick for Argentina, swung in by Messi, and flicked over his own crossbar by Sandro. Almost an embarrassing moment. It's a lovely ball hit long for Neymar, who controls it. Was he brought down? Referee says no penalty, but that must have been a mighty close call. Now Messi. Flags up. Well, I think this is a situation where I think the referee's got it right. I think if the goalkeeper makes contact, it's a penalty. Here's Neymar. Going to try and accelerate away. Oh, it's brilliant from Neymar! Was he pushed to the ground? I think he was a bit too honest there, Neymar. If he'd gone down straight away, it would have been a penalty and possibly a red card. But because he stayed on his feet, he got nothing. Well, he made no contact at the, at the vital moment. Fell over because he, he, he poked the ground, not because he was pushed in the back. Argentina looking to break with Lionel Messi, who makes no mistake. What Neymar couldn't do, Messi does. And Sabella's side a level. Well, did Argentina need this goal? Almost going two goals down seconds before. Little mistake there in the midfield. They go in, doing really well, and then he slips the ball through, and you don't leave Messi free on his own. And as soon as he he was onto the goal there, you knew that he wasn't going to miss. Little side foot into the corner, absolutely brilliant. Great work. Argentina, three against three momentarily. This time. He didn't quite pick the right pass. Forward by Mascherano. A game that has ebbed and flowed. And which is intriguingly poised right now. And here he goes again. And Messi gets there first. And Messi makes it too. Wonderful acceleration, fabulous touch, deadly finish. They have come from a goal down in the blink of an eye. Well, we see this again, and Higuain is offside, but he, uh, he doesn't want to play the ball. And Messi comes from deep. You talked about the problems that uh, Argentina had defensively. I think that Brazil are guilty of trying to play too high a line. Good play there by Sosa, wasn't it? Because he. You feel that when Neymar is running at the defence, he'll go past the last man. Great defensive work just to get back. Mascherano caught in possession. It's Neymar again. Option is Hulk for 2-2. Two, two. two great chances for Hulk. But right from uh, the MetLife Stadium. And as if by magic, here they are. And right on cue, we rejoin. <laughs> that would have been just about perfect. Apart from that, he didn't miss anything. Just been waiting till he got back. But uh, good run there by Zabaleta. Opening goal. Little dink forward to Hulk, who was having his shirt tugged. And Rodriguez now gets across. He gets to the final, but they, they just don't get around to doing it. Lovely skill there from Oscar, and it breaks for Neymar. Terrific stop that by Romero got to his feet and spread himself so quickly. That was very brave, because the chances are that after, with the follow-through, he could... It's a good ball in from the centre-half, and Sandro knows he should have scored. Great play from Juan Jesus there.
and Sandro looked like he was going to meet it perfectly. Well, there is the half-time whistle, and frankly, can't wait for the second half to get underway here. Romula gave Brazil the lead on 23, but then two quick-fire goals from Lionel Messi mean that the half-time score at the MetLife Stadium is Brazil 1, Argentina 2. 34 wins apiece is the generally... There's Di Maria with a fantastic ball again towards Messi. And Lionel Messi on a hat-trick, of course, and trying to feed it through to Higuain, who was a judge to be offside, and just better be careful what he says now. Well, he must have been outside for the first pass. Well, there have been opportunities where players could have gone down with they and, and both sides. Neat turn there by Hulk. He's still going. What about that for a run? Trying to crash it into the roof of the net and very nearly succeeding. There's a moment that will excite Chelsea fans. Well, he's done everything but keep the ball down. What a run this is. Past both players. Well, maybe the uh, keeper's previous saves put Hulk under pressure. Here's Di Maria now to try and make it free. The theme of a wide-open game continues here. Didn't really want to use it. And now at the other end to accelerate. Here's Di Maria. Looking again for Higuain. Should have been free. Beautifully teed up by Di Maria for his Real Madrid teammate. He couldn't take his chance. It's a brilliant run again, but what a great ball by Di Maria. Again, the Brazilian central defenders caught square. Again, a clever run by Higuain. Again, the Brazilian struggle to contain. And this time... Neymar. Can Brazil draw level? They just might! And they have! And it's Oscar with the goal! The hero of that World Under-20 final scores for the seniors here. Yeah, it's a Took very it wonderfully well. Very simple there, isn't it? Just these, he just slips a ball into Damião, who lays it off very simply, and nobody stays with him. Lovely touch, and it's a lovely finish as well. By Oscar, I think we just saw a little picture there of Rafael, but it was Oscar. Suddenly, it's Argentina making all the mistakes, and it's going to be a yellow card for. Javier Mascherano. Well, I've got to agree with you, the referee's been had a very good game. Ball inside by Di Maria, but oh, I thought good challenge by Sandro. Referee disagrees. I think it's a great challenge. He's won the ball clean. I guess that'll do. Well, you, you think about uh, how much possession the Brazilians have. It would be interesting to see the stats on that loan. But they uh, again the in the second half the Brazilians have dominated. It's just these little periods where they, they lose a little bit of the concentration. Good service, another quick free kick. And once again Argentina fell asleep. And really, this time it was taken by Hulk, but I could say Brazil ought to be three two up. It, Richly entertaining, and now Messi, best player in the world, on a hat trick. But it's Neymar with the corner. It was nearly a free header. In the end, it trickles behind. More for another corner. Yeah, the Tato is about to come on, as you probably saw. When you talk about young Brazilian players, you forget Tato's only 22. Just seems to have been around for a long time. He's already scored over 50 goals for AC Milan. A year or so, Pato. Injuries haven't helped. Loss of form as well, but he's still... 
Given away again. And Pato might just be in, but... Now here's Hulk. Two in support, might not need either as Hulk tries to go alone, but... Mascherano closed down the space. In again from Neymar. His corners are so good! And it's led to a goal for Hulk! Argentina came from one down. Brazil have come from two one down. Chelsea's new star makes his mark at the MetLife. We won't get an easier goal in this. What a mistake this is for Romero. He's had a fantastic game. And what's he do? He spoils it all. What an error that is. It's Aguero to take it. It's a free header. They are back level thanks to Federico Fernandez. Remarkable game. No one can make the decisive move. Well, I was just going to ask the question. Uh, are we going to see another error for the goal? And again, the market is poor. There's nobody on the back post. Uh, here's Marcelo. And then it's driven out with such... Those old pictures will really relish that. Well, that's a missed kick and it's going to reach Neymar. Chance for 4-3. Fernandez, who got Argentina's third, prevents Brazil's fourth. Fant fantastic anticipation. But this ball is... Here goes Lionel Messi. Trying to maybe win this game. Taken down cynically. Certain yellow card. He was nearly through and it was only a trip that stopped him. Danilo, the substitute, the culprit. But still, this is dangerous. Well, if he takes him out, he really should go off. He stopped the, he stopped his goal-scoring opportunity. I know it's, it's outside the box, but... Here's a... Can he? Oh, he nearly can. Good save by Rafael Cabral. This is very close to his body. This is a great free kick. Give you an idea of the attendance here. There's another punch, Shrimp. Rafael Cabral. Now Brazil can counter it. Turned out to be a useful punch, and they've got so many players over here. Five against three. Mora with the touch. Casemiro slips as he hits it. What a waste. Well, it was four against two for a long time. I think it's... Uh, it's not like Brazil to give you the opportunity when, you, when they've got an extra man. Here goes Messi, they're backing off and backing off! It's a wonder goal by Lionel Messi! A hat-trick for Lionel Messi! And the best player in the world might just have won this game for Argentina! Well, this is absolutely fantastic. What a strike this is. I don't care about the goalkeeper, who he is in there, he's not going to stop that. But what a strike. And there was no error in the, in the scoring of this goal. This is just magical. What a strike. Right in that top corner. Just set up for him just before. 5-4 win for Brazil yet. Especially with Aguero on the pitch, who knows all about that too. And that wasn't a great uh, challenge there. Between the two, it was Lavezzi with the tackle, it's a red card. Red card for Ezekiel Lavezzi. He went in high on Marcelo, and he still isn't finished, and he's... Final chance maybe for Brazil here. But there is the final whistle, and it's Argentina who have the win. Richly enjoyable game, rather marred at the end by a double sending off, but Romula gave Brazil the lead on 23. Then it was Messi and Messi in the space of four minutes to make it 2-1 Argentina. Oscar and Hulk made it 3-2 in favour of Brazil in a topsy-turvy game.
Fernandez equalised 15 minutes from time, and then Lionel Messi with a sensational goal to win a sensational game, and it finished at the MetLife.